What is your name? Practica. Family name. Super TL. Year of birth. 1968. Where were you born? Dresden, Deutsche Demokratische Republik. Anything else for you? In this ad from 1969. Stop, stop it. It's just an ad. Okay, then try how I work today after 55 years. In my hands is a Super TL model of Practica, very modern for the time it was produced. This is the film rewind lever, the shutter button is on the front. In the black circle are the setting knob for shutter speeds. Button to rewind after we've taken all the frames. Aperture ring, and ring for manual focus. Meter key. Shutter release. The Practica Super TL is a 35mm single lens reflex camera. To insert a film strip, open the cover from the side button. Pull out the rewind knob as far as it will go. Place the cartridge into the cartridge chamber and push the rewind knob with slight backward and forward movements right back into the camera. Carrier shaft will engage in the core of the cartridge. Push the lower perforation of film from above underneath the little support over the transport sprocket, and place the beginning of the film strip onto the core of the take-up spool as far as the marking point. A full guide with details about the camera can be found at the link in the description below. We take several blank frames until the frame counter shows one. We are now ready to take the first shots and immediately go looking for a location for the photos. I chose central London as the location for the photo shots. I start with an intricately lit object. The next shot is the 169-foot Nelson's column at Trafalgar Square. Also at Trafalgar Square is the National Gallery it houses a collection of over 2,300 paintings. The next shot is an amazing Mary Poppins statue in Leicester Square Gardens. In the same place is Charlie Chaplin a work of 1979 by the sculptor John Doubleday. The Shaftesbury Memorial Fountain, popularly as Eros at Piccadilly Circus. Check out the world's largest rock shop at Hard Rock Cafe Piccadilly Circus. Take a selfie with Mr. Bean at Leicester Square Garden. To be, or not to be, since 1874, statue of William Shakespeare quietly watching. And we quietly watch our film negative and rejoice in our success. World War II to its end. Allied bombing between the 13th and the 15th of February 1945 almost completely destroyed the German city of Dresden, called Florence on the Elbe. The four of largest German camera manufacturers were there. Also almost destroyed by the bombing. Germany was divided and Dresden remained in the Russian occupation zone. Occupied for 45 years. Recovery from war takes a long time. An old newsreel from 1949 shows the empty camera factory. 10,000 machines and 300 specialists were brought to Russia as reparations. 1966 to 20 years after the end of the war, East German television broadcasts a report on the successes of the state-owned Pentagon camera factory. The achievements of German engineers are amazing. The camera is precisely made and gaining popularity. An impressive 63 models were produced between 1949 and 2001. With the collapse of communism and the fall of the Berlin Wall, the camera declined in popularity and lost the battle with its competitors, the production stopped in 2001. Practica cameras leave a huge mark in the development of photographic technique in the world.